general law, but as well, but as well, when God allowed it as well, because God knows tabarak wa ta'ala, that first the people, they have their own, for example, their own desire, etc. Yeah. And at that time as well, Allah Azza wa has made it clearly in the Quran about the marriage, with the marriage is a good alternative choice and the best alternative choice, which is establish a family. The idea is behind all of that, and and, and the idea is behind all of that, still we do, we cannot say this is prostitution. If you wanted to say so, it's not a prostitution. Now we finish this. Now let's go back to the no, we finish no, it. No, no, we finished it. You no, said no. you said it's a prostitution, I said no. So no, let's go back to the point. Now now the question no, is now the question the question the question is is it permissible? Is it permissible? Is it permissible? Is it is it is it from God legislation for a man to sleep with, with seven hundred women? Seven hundred Yes, yes. Is it is it God legislation? No. No, it's not God legislation. 700. With 700 women. So it's not God legislation. So this, what do you call someone who sleeps with 700 women? That's, what would I call it? Yeah, you, yeah, give me a name. That would be fornication, isn't it? Fornication? No, it depends. If the person is married, yeah, no, that's no, no, fornication. No. No, sorry, if the is married, that's adultery. If the person is not married, that's fornication. So, with 700 women. So with 700 women, so it's not allowed? It's not allowed. So how Sulaiman did it then? How did he do it? How did he do it then? Was he a fornicator? Is that what? Was Suleiman a fornicator? Well, I don't know. If he sleep with 700... Yeah, yeah, yeah. He has 700. Yeah. So, and so, this by this by legislation by God. By who? By God. You, God. How? How? Read, well, the, well, read the Old Testament. Show me where in the Bible. Did you read, did okay, you read the Old Testament? Done, done, did you read the Old Testament? I did. Did you read the Old yes. Testament? Yes. Did Suleiman? Did Suleiman? Did Suleiman? Was Suleiman a prophet of God? That's not what I said. <laughs> was Solomon prophet of God? Show me where God says. Was Solomon? Was Solomon prophet of God? Yes. Was yes. he was a prophet of God? Yeah, yeah. So the prophet of God, he will do what God legislates, correct? Yeah. So when but when he can disobey yeah. God as well. How, when, how, 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 so okay. was it from God command? So, so was it from? Yeah. Not, yeah, open, 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 open it. Unless if you can show. Open, me open it, open it, open it, open it. So when that God approved, actually, yeah, yeah, he married. He was married. Yeah, yeah. That's what I said. He he was married. Married. We just come on, come on. We're talking about number. We're not talking about number. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We are talking about number. We are talking about the number. We're talking about the number. You just said. You just said. What are you guys talking about? We're talking about the number. What number are you talking about? The number, the 700 number. Yeah, 700 yeah, 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 700 women. Okay. But did God command him to marry 700? It was approved by God. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. 1 Kings 11. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, read, read, read. Read, read, read. Oh, boy. Read, read. You see here, that's, you see here, they say we he have... He had a, yeah? 700 wives of royal birth and 300 so, concubines. So, 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 so that's 1,000. That's 700, the marriage one. No, this marriage, marriage. No, yeah. This lawful marriage, they call wives, no, yeah? Is that, is that, is that from waiting. God? Is that I'm from waiting. God? Listen. Is that from God? Listen. Is that from God? Listen. Is marriage, marriage. God? By the way. Listen. Is that from God? I'm waiting for what I'm God asking says. you. By the way. From God? He will not answer. He doesn't want to answer. He doesn't want to answer. He doesn't want to answer. I'm waiting for you to show me where God says. Listen, listen. I'm sure. I will tell you. 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 I have one second. One second. One second. One second. One second. Solomon. Listen. I will tell you. 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 Show me where. In in your according to you. One second. One second. Do you know what? Do you know the difference between wife? One second. 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 Is that Old Testament not from God? Show me where God says. No, no. Is this not? What commandment is? No, okay, okay. One king you know eleven. I am is? giving one king eleven. Read it. Do you know what? Listen, listen. I will tell. I will tell you. What's what's that? What's that? Do you know? Do you not understand English? Hey, hey. Do you not understand English? No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't understand English. He doesn't understand English. He doesn't understand English. Do understand 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 okay. English. Okay. Going back. Listen, listen. I will tell you. I will tell you. I will tell you that. Tell me. Listen. Do you know the difference between wife and concubine? Yes, I know. What's the wife? According to your scripture. The one that you marry. So according to your scripture, the wife is the one that you marry. Yes. So when Suleiman has 700 wives, right, wives, so he was married, he was married, lawfully married, lawfully. Those are, they are not called concubines, they are not they are called prostitutes, as you said, they are, they are called wives, not, I didn't, did I, did I call it wives? Who called it wives? It says it's in the Bible. Who said, who called it wives? The God. So God what called it wives. <laughs> is the Old Testament word of God? What are you talking about? Yeah. Is the Old Testament word of God? It is word of God. So the Old Testament word of God called the wives of Solomon seven hundred wives. Okay. So the your and God, your God called it wives. Yeah. Yes, your God. Yeah, your God. Yeah. yeah. 
your God, no, no, I'm saying, your God called Solomon, he had 700 wives, these are lawful. Why? Because God called it wives. If God said to him, uh, criticize him, you cannot have more than one wife, then yes, I, I understand. But actually, it's not the choice there of Solomon. No when God has God. called them, when your God called them wives, that yeah. means God recognized them to be wives. That means God recognizes to be wives. That's one thing. The other thing as well, God recognizes that he is having concubines as well. 300 extra on top of the 700 wives. He has 300 concubines. You want God to lie. You just said now. You want God to lie. You just said now. Are you lying about yeah. God? You're lying. About, you you are God lying about yeah? God. You want God to lie. I'm not saying, he doesn't need to lie. Lying. You said, listen, listen. Can I talk? Listen, you want God to when lie. I'm saying the word of God, when you are using the word of God you and you believe, lie. You believe the Old Testament is the word of God. Yes. Uh, yeah. So since the, the, the Old Testament is the word of God, the Old Testament recognized but the wives, the 700 wives for Suleiman. Yes. So they, are, this, yeah. so they are recognized wives go, for Suleiman and as well recognize that he has 300 concubines. You, you just lie. said, you just shot yourself in a, in a foot just now. What you said, and we have when you said, evidence, someone who married 700 wives, you, have you said, no, and okay. you that's a prostitute. It. This is fornication. You, you just said lie. this. You want God to lie. No, answer this now. No, no, answer this. I'm not answering. I'm not answering. I'm not answering this. married 700 wives. Do you want God to lie that he didn't marry 700 wives? Is that what you want? No. If that's what you did, I you say, to lie to him listen. and say he didn't marry 700. If Solomon married 700, it's different from yeah, yeah. when God says, Solomon, go and marry 700 wives. Good, good. Did you finish? Did you finish? Do you understand that? I understand. Did you finish? Did you finish? Yes, I have. Okay, good. So English is not my first language, yeah? It's not mine. Is yeah, it? no, it's yours, I think, apparently. You're not Nigeria. You're Nigeria, yeah? Yeah, it's Nigeria. So, but yet, look at this. The irony is, when, I, when I'm reading the book of God, yeah? Yes. And I open the Old Testament according to you. Yeah. Opening the Old Testament, yes. and which you believe is the word of God. Yes. When God is recognizing, you know, understand? So God is not saying he took 700 women. He didn't say that. He could have said, took 700 women. Slept with 700 women. You name all of that. He didn't say this. You, God, called them wives. Not me, you, God. So when you God called them wives, that means according to him is wives, correct? correct. Please, my English is not my first language. Some people criticize me. They say, you know, you don't, you no, no speak London. They say to me, <laughs> no talk London. I, I think you say, no talk London. So anyway, so let, listen to me. If, if, if I am a legislator, you know, in the court, and I say, addressing, uh, for example, Abdullah, I will say, Abdullah, Abdullah has 10 wives, yeah? When I'm saying this, now in that case, I'm affirming by someone with authority, yeah. affirming those 10 wives. But if, if Abdullah is breaching the law, for example, in this country, you are allowed to have one wife, for example. I will say to Abdullah, I will say Abdullah committed a crime by he should have only one wife and the other women, they are not recognized, correct? As a legislator. So when God, as a legislator, according to you, legislated and affirmed that Suleiman has 700 wives, adding 300 concubines, the total is, you know, and, and, the, and the idea, the irony here is there is distinction between wives and concubines. So he could have said, you know, all of them concubines, yeah, or could have said women, but God, you God said 700 wives with the 300 concubines. So those are recognized by God. So it's not a lie on earth. I just asked you a minute ago, with someone someone having 700 wives, you said he's either a fornicator, you said, yeah, because he cannot have more than that. No, according to you, so you are now addressing you, God, to affirm fornication. Subhanallah. Okay, are you finished? That's what you have done. Are you finished? Yes, that's what I finished. Can I talk now? What I said to you is this. You want God to lie? I'm and talking said, about your early statement. Said, Repeat your early statement. Listen, do you want to retract your early statement? I'm not retracting anything. So you, the, when you said, when you said the one who have 700 wives is a fornicator, you said this earlier, yes? It's on the camera. It's, it's on the camera. It's on the camera. You said, said, you said as follows. I'm not changing anything. Yeah. So you doing? said, I said, what do you think of someone having 700 wives? You said to me, it is either a fornicator because he cannot have more than one wife. Correct? That's what you said earlier. No, if you're a Christian, you cannot have more than one wife. You are talking about, listen, what you said is this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You ask me if a man 
Yeah, yeah. Are you okay? If a man I married, married seven, yes, 700 wives. And I said, oh, it depends. I said, if if, if you marry more than 700 wives. But it's recorded. Are, so, I, by the way, I don't I want the people to call you a liar. I said, you're a fornicator. That is your married. I said, sorry, if you're married, that means you're... Uh, adulterer. You know why adulterer. he's adulterer? You know why he's adulterer? So, you're not married. Listen. Said, Jesus, you're not married. You're a, yeah, you're you're a fornicator. fornicator. Look, look. look. He, he made it worse, by the way. No, no, he yeah. said, if you are married, yeah. if you are married, married, which means the first wife is your wife. Is the wife. The other one is adulterer. Why? That means you are adulterer. That, that, and if you are not married, if you are not married, yes, yes. Jesus is the God of all the So Suleiman was believer in God or not? Solomon wasn't a Christian. Ah! What? Was Solomon a Christian? Oh, Did he believe in Jesus? Did he believe in Jesus? Oh, no, he is no, the no. God of Do I need to the God of all Did, did Solomon believe in Jesus? What do you mean believe in Jesus? Did he believe in Jesus as God? As God. As you? No. So Solomon was didn't believe in Jesus as God? No. Wow. <laughs> no, 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 no. Brother, brother, come to Islam, bro. Come, to Islam. come on. What's what's nonsense that? Oh. That means oh. Christianity. So that means the Christianity. So that means the Christianity is an injection to the theology of the Judaism. Correct? Did Jesus Christ meet Solomon? But Jesus Christ is the God of Old Testament. No, no, no. Jesus Christ is the God of Old Testament. They are understanding. In person, no. No. So how can Solomon be Christian? Good. How can he follow Christ's rule and law? Good. How can he follow? Is Jesus God? Is Jesus God? God. Yes. Good. Is he the God? Is God? What do you mean, the God? Means the one who, for example, the the the, the creator, the, 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 the law in the Old Testament. Who and was giving? Who was giving the law in the Old Testament? God. Which one, Jesus? Yahweh. So Jesus. Yahweh. So not Jesus. Yahweh. Because you it, don't understand it. So. So uh, okay. You're argue over no, 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 no. Yeah. So. Yeah. Is Jesus Yahweh? Jesus is Yahweh. Yeah. So, so basically, Jesus is is the one who gave the or the Old Testament. Yeah. Did Suleiman believed in exactly. Yahweh? Exactly yeah. this. Yes, he believes in Yahweh. So, so according to you, that means he's like a Christian, like you, correct? Now, show me where in Old Testament where Yahweh says, <laughs> "Marry only one." Show me where it says, "Marry only one" in, Yahweh, in Old Testament. Listen, but I'll show you in the New Testament. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? Where it says, Look how silly! Only one. I will tell you something. What? Look how silly is your, even, no, your theology. It, no, Look how silly. silly? Look, silly? you just said now. Yeah. Meaning, when you said just now, and that's my, that's my advice, when you just said that Solomon wasn't Christian, yes, wasn't was, Christian. Yeah, wasn't a Christian. Meaning, what is the definition of a Christian? People that follow Christ. God. Did Solomon follow Christ? No. Again, did Solomon believe in Yahweh? Yes. Is and Jesus Yahweh? Yahweh? Oh, Lord. Is Jesus, is Jesus, Jesus, the, is Jesus the, uh, the God of the Old Testament? Yeah. Yes, it is. So he's the God of all just the testament. Yes, and he's God of so, so Solomon believed in Jesus. He believes in mosaic, mosaic law, not New, New Testament. Good. New law. So the question is to you. That's I wanted to get you to this. Is it, is it different or different? is it? No, it's just, it's, 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 it's different. different. It's different. It's different. So Do you why, know what? Why will he follow something that good, good, wasn't good. there before? Good, good. Is it a sin yeah. in the sight of God yeah. to marry seven hundred women? Uh, I don't know. No, you know. Are you talking about now or before? So, so that means it was allowed before. Are you talking about now or before? Now. Now. Yeah. It's the same. Before. I don't know. It's not, the the it's proof. Not the proof is Suleiman married more he, than. He did. Yeah. Jacob married more than one wife. Yeah. So that's so, what I'm saying. It's not. So it's not a sin. In 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 the in the. So it's Old not Testament, a sin. In the Old Testament. So it's not a sin. I don't know because he didn't say whether it's, it's a sin or not. Simple as that. So God said, "We well, you know anyone who breached the laws, the sinner." Yes. Yes. Don't kill. Don't lie. Don't all lie, of this. Yeah? Lie, yeah. Yeah. So someone didn't do it. Still, it's not a sin. Sorry. Anyone did other than that. Someone who didn't lie, yeah. didn't fornicate, yeah. didn't do all of that. Yeah. So it's not a sinner. Correct. Not a sinner, yeah. yeah. So Suleiman wasn't wasn't sinning by by marrying seven hundred women. Like I said, in order for you to prove it's some, something is a sin. Come on, you have to show come on, that God come on. Says, listen, listen. Don't do this. No, no, no. You're going yes, against yes. So, so, so basically, in the Old Testament, basically, how many religion? wives did God say you are allowed to marry in the Old Testament? No restrictions. So, how is he a sin then? So, it's not a sin. There's no so, yeah, there is no sin. That's why it's not a sin. It's not a sin. It's not a sin. It's not a sin. Yeah, it's not a sin. So, if it's not a sin, so why are we talking about it? The po I'm talking about it yeah. because what you, I wanted just to because I, I will tell you something. Yeah. yeah. I'm not belittling your intellectual ability. It doesn't matter. Yeah, but I'm not. I'm not belittling. But I'm yeah. just wanted to tell you, yeah. because you you came here, yeah. Yeah, talking about muta in Islam. 
Yeah. And you said, yes. how come, say? how come, for example, yeah. something, God, yeah, go God for example, yeah. in the past used to be, uh, you yeah. know, it's okay. And then God, uh, God allowed it. And then God later on didn't Prohibit allow it, it. prohibited. Yes. Yes. Yeah. So if it's wrong, it should be wrong there, it should be wrong and, here. And his argument was, So it's yes. exactly, that's not what I said. it is no, exactly, no, no. That's not what I said. it is exactly. It's on the camera, it's on the camera, don't lie. It's on the camera. No, no, don't shush him, don't listen, he's older than you, he's older than you. How old are you? How old are you? How old are you? For what you just said, Nadai, so that I know, you have to tell me his age first. I'm not going to tell you. How old your age, brother? I'm 35. 35. So how can you say he's older than me? He's older. He's older than you? How can you say he's older than me? Okay, then fine. So the speaker, don't shush him. Carry on. Okay, sorry for saying shush. Sorry. Sorry for saying shush. Okay. Your apology is accepted. No, no, don't interrupt. Because I'm talking to you, please. He can, he can interrupt. We are giving you. Okay. Let's go back to the... See, the thing is here, we're going back to the muta. What I said to you about muta is this. If it is from God, Allowed by God. It's not, not, not from God. Allowed, allowed, no, no, no. allowed. If it's allowed by no, no. God. You need to understand yeah, the allowed difference. Allowed by God. Allowed by God. Let allowed me tell you God. something. And I will tell you something if just to hint. Give, you, give you a hint. Give That's you a hint. Yeah, it's not a sin, yes. That's it was, a, did I it say was that? not a sin. Did I say yes, that? you said that. I said if it's from God. No, it's from God. I didn't say from God. I said it's allowed by God. It's not a sin. That's not a sin. Yes. And I said, hold on, listen to what I said. I said, then what's the concept of muta? Do you consider it to be prostitution or not? No. Well then, you said no. In the past, no. No, no, not in the past or present. In the, the past, no. Is what I'm saying. Forget. No, 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 no. It's different. Is it's exactly the same. I'm, I'm trying to use your own intellectual ability, not my own, my one, you one, to tell you, yeah, to tell you as follows. It's exactly in the same concept. When God recognized. No, the marriage, you when God, no, you don't. That means you don't have the same. The concept of muta. Yeah, the same. The concept of having seven hundred wives. Again, the concept of having seven hundred wives yeah. recognized by God, which is later on abrogated to have only one wife, which you said now is a fornicator. It's a sin now, but in the past you cannot say it's a sin. It's exactly in the same standard that I'm talking to you about it now. It's exactly in the same way. I'm just trying to use the same analogy, exactly in the same way. For us as Muslims, it was allowed by God, not, not hey, legislated, okay, allowed way. by God, and then God abrogated it to say it's is, is uh, for heaven haram. So that's why for us now, for us now, the big you difference. You, you, Again, you you the same it. as, the because same as, one second, the same, I will tell you, I will the same, the same as the difference between someone marrying 700 wives and one wife. It's got the same, the same concept. It's the same thing. Okay. Yeah, the same thing. So you're telling me, yeah, yeah. before Muta was prohibited, the concept is prostitution. Is that what you're saying? No, I didn't say that. I said it was recognized in Islam, which is per permitted in Islam, and then prohibited after that. So it's exactly the same concept. What, what, no, the same, the same concept. One second, no, no problem. The what same concept, concubine? the same concept with someone having 700 wives nowadays. Yeah. I don't know when he'll have the time to, to, to sleep with them, sorry yeah. to say it even that. Yeah. So anyway, so he have 700 wives. And nowadays, of course, it's impossible. But Sulaiman alayhi salam, Allah Azza wa give him the ability. Maybe, maybe, it's, uh, maybe that's something which we don't know. We cannot affirm, we cannot negate for us. But these things, it could happen. And Allah Azza wa affirm that Sulaiman, he was married to many women. Uh, so you know the difference between what yeah. you said and what yeah. I said? Yeah. The difference is... show me where it says in the, in the, in the Bible okay. that God commands it. It's, okay, it. the same thing. There I is no... Com where, it's exactly, I will tell I you that. Show you where I will tell you what Allah it is. Commands there is difference. Muta. There is, by the way, by the way, by the way, no, 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 by the way, no, 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 I will tell you, in Islam, in Islam, Allah didn't command, no, Allah didn't command, and for you to know, there is no commandment, Allah recognized, and that's totally different things, the same, permitted, the same as, as the same as when God permitted Sulaiman, the same as, in read the Quran, Allah said, permit you to do this, I permit you to do this, again, good, 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 Good. 700. 700. Okay. When God is recognizing the wives of Suleiman, those are I'm called. I'm done. I'm done. Yeah, I'm sorry. Go. You said when God. Where's the camera? Okay. Sorry. I thought they put a. No, no, no. Right. So. Thank you. Thank you. It's done. You know, no, I'm I'm done. There is no I'm thank I'm you. Done. Done. I want to show you something more dangerous. I'm done. I'm if done. you look at Genesis I'm 19. Done. I'm done. Yeah, what? If you look at. If, if you look at incest. Where it says I permit it. You, your God is allowing Lord to sit asleep with his own daughter. You don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, we know what you're talking about.
Yeah, 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 anyways. Anyways. But God didn't say so. No. By the way, by the way. God not allow it. Okay. Anyways, that's good. That is good. By the way, I wanted to mention something here. Because they sometimes they want to, to, to attack Islam. From sometimes from nonsense places. You, you see here, they say we have a we have a saying back home. If you have if your house, if your house made of glass, don't throw stones in the other <laughs> You know, you know. The issue is that this guy is saying that God, not just all, he said God commanded it. Allah didn't command the muta. No. Allah allowed the muta. And those are totally different things. Allah allowed the muta. And it was for him, initially it was, people used to do it. And Allah allowed it at a certain point. And then Allah prohibited it. That means it's not necessarily inherently prohibited or inherently haram or inherently wrong. wrong. So, so it, it was at a certain point allowed. And Allah allowed it, and it was recognized by Allah Azza wa Meaning, because people, these are from the marriage of the, marriage yeah. of the people in the, before the law came, yeah. and before the, the Prophet Sallallahu prohibited, and died, alayhi salatu wasalam, prohibiting the muta alayhi salatu wasalam. So the muta is more dangerous, I believe, than prostitution, for you to know. Yeah. Nowadays, more dangerous, because not just only, because people, they're doing it, yeah. thinking that they are doing something right. Where prostitution or something, or people they do wrong thing, they know they fornicate, they do, they repent to Allah, etc. But people they do it as an act of worship, and that's totally, that's totally against Islam. So the other thing as well, which is adding to this, which he was saying, is exactly the same concept. To say when God has recognized the wives of Sulaiman, this recognition is up, is approval, the same as Islam recognized as well the but in the in the beginning, uh, in the beginning of Islam. Then Allah Azzawajal prohibited later on, for example, according to them, and but they accepted it. They have no problem to do that. But when it comes to us, no, they have all, all kind of things. And they wanted a commandment. You don't need to have a commandment of God. And actually, why we go far? When, when God has said to Moses, go and bring even the daughters of those old young women who didn't meet any man, bring them to me. So that shows even Musa, peace be upon him, he has already wife yeah. and yet to bring other, 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 other girls. Girls, yeah. girls. girls. Yeah. to him. Yeah, according to them. So the same Jesus was commanding that. Yeah. So that's why we have to understand this. And we have as well, we, are, we ask Allah the first to guide him. It seems that he's genuine, but he's confused, by the way. And, 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 uh, to the, on that matter, Sheikh, you know, in the book of Leviticus, yeah. this adultery and fornication are prohibited. Yeah. But the same Genesis in the first chapter of the Old Testament is mentioned about the incest of lords. Yeah. He's sleeping with his own daughter. And thus, uh, uh, in the first night, the, the daughter are allowing a, a, a lord to drink wine and sleep with her and getting seed of her own father. And the, the following night, the second daughter goes and sleep with, with, with Why the, we go, with the go, go back to the lineage, one of the ancestors of, of the, one of the ancestor, one so of the ancestor the, of, the, book, of, of the whole yeah. point of Sheikh, I was saying, that their book is promoting incest. Yeah, they promote all the kind and of things. He's coming with legalization, marriage, and what Allah allowed within the frame of the boundaries. And that shows as well that That's Islam, so when Islam, when Islam put draw line for the mut'ah, yeah. because Allah Azzawajal wanted the, the the harmony and 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 the, yeah. and the mercy to be between husband and wife, yes. not just only just only for the leisure of the period and then to move on. And that's the idea by the of the prohibition. Yeah. Exactly. Like you, you, you bring the standard in, yeah. you apply the standard and we tested it. <laughs> and when he is tested, he knows he has no legs to stand on. <laughs> and that's why he ran away. So I asked Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to guide him. Jazakallah khair. Jazakallah khair. Jazakallah khair.